Good morning and welcome to Nora's Dog Training Company. We're here today with Fred and Tasha and what we're going to be demonstrating for you today on video is her ability to understand and respond to her formal on-leash obedience commands, the correction and the motivation that we give the dogs when we're working with them and the training equipment that we're using. Fred is using a regular six-foot web training leash and he keeps the bulk of that leash folded in his right hand which leaves his left hand free to give correction. And the only correction that we give is a tug and release on the training collar. And that is the second piece of equipment that we're using. She's gonna come home with her very own training collar and you're gonna be taught how to use that when you pick her up. Now she is sitting very nicely at Fred's left, which is where all of our obedience training is done. And the first exercise that we're gonna be demonstrating for you is healing. Tasha. Healing is proper walking on a leash and the command is Tasha heal. At this point, she has a job to do, and that is to stay even with her trainer's left leg, not forging ahead or lagging behind, but matching not only pace, but, you know, tempo with him, focusing on what he's doing and not what she wants to be doing. And being able to be walked like a lady on the street with nice automatic sits, and you saw her sit when Fred stopped walking, and that's what she's been taught to do. So when you stop to cross traffic, she should sit automatically without being told. Now the next command that we're gonna demonstrate is the sit-stay. The stay is a hand and a voice command. Stay. And because it is a stationary exercise, it is a one-word command. No, stay. Now she got up, and you heard Fred say, no, stay. And that's what you do. And she should hold this command for about 30 seconds and you're gonna practice until she holds it for three minutes. If you wanna return back to her, Fred. Yeah. And we're gonna do that again. Stay. And remember, all of these exercises can be used in and around your home, at the doors, all of those types of things. Now when Fred returns back to her, he walks all the way around her and she should remain seated until she gets praised and given another command and they take off healing again. She looks like we just woke her up from her nap. She's all goofy. <laughs> if you notice Fred keeping her head up off the ground so she's not sniffing. Nice automatic sit, stay. stay, walks out to the end of his training leash and faces her. And this time, instead of returning back to her like he did the last time, he's going to call her. And this is the common command. She should come right in front and sit and then go back to heel. And you see that each time he stops his feet, she sits. And this makes working her and walking with her a pleasure. And if you have to enforce it, it's just that little tug and release in the word no. Again, Fred walks out to the end of his training leash and on the recall, she's been taught to come and sit. He lightens his tone. It's always a happy command. We want her to know she's doing a good job and then she goes back to healing. Now when they get back to us, the next exercises that we're gonna be demonstrating for you are the down commands and there are two. The first one starts out with her sitting at a heel position and always have your dog sitting before you put them into a down. Fred takes his left open palm, pushes it straight down toward the ground and gives a command to down and stay. The long down stay when you're practicing at home and you can each take a dog and practice with them right in your house. You're gonna work all the way up on the down stay to five minutes. When Fred returns back to her, he walks all the way around her just as he did on the sit stay, returning all the way back around to heel and they take off healing again. And they're going to demonstrate that down from a heel one more time for us. She 
She's done a great job. She's been a lot of fun to be with and to have here as a guest. Now Fred didn't even use a verbal command that time. He just used his hand command. She went right down. There's the girl we know and love. <laughs> and this time Fred can call her if he chooses out of that exercise. And the next command that we're gonna demonstrate for you is her down from a distance. So you have her seated at your left. You give her the stay. You walk out to face her. Then you use your right hand to give the command. It's a one word command to down. And that was done perfectly. Now we've demonstrated for you her heel, her automatic sits, her sit stay, her down from a heel, her down from a distance, and her come. These are the commands that we've taught for the time that she's been here with us at school. You can continue to, you know, make those bigger and bolder and longer periods of time. We think that the dogs have done a really great job here, and thank you for choosing Nora's Dog Training Company.